My name is Phil Vontheron. I'm uh, head of integrated partnerships at Flow Sports. Uh, in my role, I'm responsible for generating revenue through advertising sales and sponsorships, uh, which obviously entails, you know, working with brands to deliver upon their objectives and kind of connect with our audience in a real way. Flow Sports is a media company dedicated to serving underserved sports. Uh, by underserved, I mean, you know, before Flow Sports, uh, these sports communities weren't getting the love, content, uh, broadcast professionalism that the big four were. Um, we now cover 25 different sports uh, like wrestling, all sorts of running, dirt racing, track and field, uh, gymnastics, cheer, kind of the list goes on and on. And what we do is we have live events. We do about 30,000 live events a year. Uh, we produce original content programming for them. Um, we do video podcasts, uh, we do training tips and all sorts of sports advice, highlights, uh, you name it, basically anything that the athletes of these sports kind of crave. During COVID, uh, being a company that uh, pretty much had live events as you know 75% of the content that we were creating. Uh, we had to get creative once uh, events were canceled. From a production standpoint, we had to figure out how um, you know how to continue to create the quality content that we were uh, remotely. Um, you know, during that time, we also developed an owned and operated event series called Who's Number One, which Tezos is actually the title sponsor of. And um, you know, we created events, uh, it, virtual events in cycling, running, and dirt racing that our audience just loved. And you know, we are kind of razor focused on scaling the business and we actually made some major acquisitions during that time in 2020, 2020 and 2021 that you know, have put our company in the best position it can be. Tezos as the official blockchain partner of Flow Sports um, will be seen across all of our sports, uh, all 25 of them uh, via media. But more specifically, we're doing lots of really cool integrations and there are sponsorships of temple opportunities within grappling, dirt racing, and wrestling. Uh, sports that we kind of did the research and found out that really kind of had already had an affinity uh, towards you know, cryptocurrencies, NFTs, and blockchain. So I think the partnership will really help build community amongst fans because it gives them a really new way to experience the sports that they are extremely passionate about. Any way that an athlete can experience a sport in a new way and get excited about it and find something new and discover something uh, is a way to boost fan engagement amongst our audience. I think it is a technology that uh, is here to stay. It is something that is going to be, you know, the base of what Web3 is, um, and it's it's proof of stake. It's it's the ability to, um, you know, own something and have something uh, of value in the digital world.